quick video today. I'm going to show you how to do a, a mock-up using Canva. We're going to do a mock-up on a computer and then a mock-up on a phone. You can put whatever you want on that computer or on that phone and then use these for your Instagram, YouTube, anything you want. Um, and I'll show you how to do that right now. Let's go ahead over to Canva, get started. All right, this is my Canva account. You can log in as well and follow along or just go ahead and watch and then go back and try your own account later. You, If you want to put your mock-up on your Instagram post or Facebook or something like that, you can literally type that in and get the right dimension. So right here I typed in Instagram. Um, depending on where you want to put it, if you want to put it on business card, anything, the, the possibilities are endless. You can even size it yourself, a custom custom size right down here. I'm going to go ahead and I just put mine on a presentation just so I could have a bigger screen. And what I want to do is I want it to go to elements over here on the left hand side. And I want to put my mock-up on a computer. So you can just type in computer mock-up under elements and then you have lots of different selections. I went ahead and chose this one here. Um, it's very simple. I might be able to put it on my website. I could put it on a document or maybe a brochure. Again, look at all the different possibilities that you have here. There's tons of them. I do want to point one thing out that if you see the little crown there, that's a pro account and you can't use those if you have the free account, but you still have a lot of choices in the free account. Now, if you want to check out the pro account, you're not really sure you want to do it. I do have a link below. You can have a free trial. I put that off forever. I kept thinking I didn't need it because there's so many free things, but if you like what you see for free, you're going to really like what you see when you start paying for it. And it's well worth it. It's one of my favorite tools that I highly recommend for anybody that likes to um, post in social media. If you're in business, you, you can just create so many things. All right. So I want this computer I have, and I'm going to show you over here. I have a course that I'm selling and that's what it looks like if you go to the page. And I wanted to do something to advertise that on the mock-up. Now, it was really hard to come over here and get the whole thing because it was too too much white space down here. So what I did is I went ahead and just took a, a snip of just this first page here. And I uploaded it. I'm going to show you where you go to do that if you've never used it before. But you go under Upload. I saved that picture that I needed in my on my desktop. And I want to show you here when I was playing around with it, First, I had too much white space around it, and I'm going to show you my mistake, okay? I, I didn't go close enough, and when I tried to put it here on the computer mock-up, it just didn't look right. You know, it took away from it, didn't look um, real. So we're going to delete that one. I went back, did it again, and I made sure I didn't have any white space this time, and definitely it came out a lot better. And we're going to go ahead and fit that in there, and there you go. You have a mock-up, and, you know, if I want to put that on my website or anywhere. Um, I can advertise the course that I'm selling. Here's another one. If you want to use it maybe for a thumbnail, um, maybe I, you know, you're advertising something on YouTube or, and you want more of a picture there to, to show it more realistically, um, then I have the desk and everything to show for it as well. If it would like that, there you go. All right. I also want to show you a phone mock-up. Okay. Cause sometimes I know a lot of people advertise on phone and they don't even use laptops anymore. And so they run their business from the phone and you have all these choices. You can just put a phone or a phone, um, somebody holding it, lots and lots of choices. Now this is the one I chose here and I went in to the uploads and actually my son runs a mortgage company. We, he uses Mike. Um, but anyway, I just put his, the name of his business there. And then he has a scan where people can go right to his website and I put it there. So look how easy you can put your business information on that mock-up. Now, here's another one. It's got a little bit, um, a picture in the back. It looks a little bit real, like somebody's looking into the, um, the phone. I went ahead and brought those same two things over. Now, what happens is I have to go ahead and turn that a little bit so that it fits. So you're going to just kind of tilt it. See that? I can turn it so that it fits on the phone. That. And bring this one over. I'm going to make that just a tiny bit smaller, just a little bit. Bring it up and do the same with this. We'll go ahead and turn it so it looks more realistic. And is that cool? There you go. It looks really cool, doesn't it? You can put anything on there. Now, very quickly, because I told you this would be quick. Um, for those of you who aren't familiar with the different frames that are in the elements, I think it's really important for you to see this because there's so many different things that you can do. 
But if you go under frames in your elements, you can see all of these different types. And when you look at it, you're like, well, what's that picture doing there? That's just there to hold it. Um, once you put your picture on top of it, it goes away. So here I have a circular frame and this is an advertisement for the mortgage business. Watch what it does when I pull it over. Look how fast, look at that, beautiful, perfect shape. Now here's another one. This one's got a kind of a cutout feel to it. Let's go into our uploads and this will be the last one that I'll show you. Uh, let's see, what do we got here? How about that? If you're in the mortgage or real estate business for sale, there you go, look at that. Look how cool that is. And then you can take that image and apply it someplace else. There you go, guys. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up, comment below, and don't forget to subscribe. I appreciate you watching and you have a blessed day. Thank <laughs> you.